People are having sex without condoms forever. It's this is not new. Do I think they become complacent? No, I think that undetectable equals untransmittable with PrEP provide us two more tools in the arsenal. Condoms and PrEP and U equals U and you know, those are all really effective tools. So has I think have become complacent? No, I think we still have 40,000 new infections each year. I think that, you know, gay men, straight people continue to engage in sexual behaviors. People, I think that the, the complacency doesn't arise when people um, are on treatment or on prep i think the complacency arises when people trust and are in love i have long said that lots of the lots of risk and there is documented evidence for this occurs within the context of a relationship so i think what we need to do is teach young people to be able to learn how to navigate and manage the dynamics of their relationships to continue to stay safe to have open conversations with their partners but they don't place themselves at risk so uh, you know, a colleague said, you know, we, well, somebody's single, they should be on prep. I'm like, I think when somebody starts a relationship, they should be on prep, you know, because that's why I think the minute you enter, I love you into the equation, all rational decision making goes out the door. And so, yeah, I mean, look, I think the other advantage we have is that it looks like in, in the next five years, I hope maybe sooner, we will have an injectable version of prep that's available. We'll have an injectable version of treatment, which is available. And that will just make people's lives much easier than having to take pills every single day. And I think that's, that's a game changer for us.